This is Brian Watkins and this is my video tutorial for Pivot Table B3 in which we're using the order reports data file and we're extracting various information. For B3 we are asked to extract the average unit price for each product. So we start, we do our insert pivot table. Yes, we have our product and we're asked to extract the average unit price. So we're going to click unit price. It defaults and gives us the sum. And in A3 you can read clearly that this is the sum of unit price. We don't want the sum. We want the average. So we go to value field settings. Let me pull this down so you can see that just to be sure. So I'm going to left click, value field settings, and I'm going to select the average function. Average. So while on the one hand this report seems awfully easy, I've noticed that when it comes time to uh, test students on this, and let's uh, let's just fix our number up here to a um, number with two decimal places. When it comes time to test students on this concept, oftentimes they just go for the sum function and forget that there are a number of functions of which average is only one. But we were asked to do a report that said the average unit price. Uh, there's our information. So we just format it. Uh, let's, use, uh, let's use a format that has alternating dark is good and we'll go to option or design and we'll do the banded rows. There we go. So everything is good. We have the average of unit price.